no time to meet with law-breaking pirates like you. That's just it, we're not pirates. We're legally incorporated heroes for hire. Yeah, that's right. You check those records, Buckethead. Novacore Licensing Permit 67398-2. Gardeners of the Galaxy? What? No. Rocket! So, I let Groot fill out the paperwork. I fixed it with an addendum. Not the most well-known heroes you could hire, but definitely in the top five of most awesome names. Contributing members. Groot, a Flora Colossus. Last of his kind, fearless in a firefight, an awesome best friend. Rocket, bona fide super genius and a wizard with explosives. Definitely not a raccoon. Gamora, adopted daughter of Thanos, deadliest woman in the galaxy. Need we say more? Drax the Destroyer, convicted serial murderer and galactic war hero, often grumpy. Last and definitely least, Peter Jason Quill. That's it? That's all you wrote? There was a character limitation. <sighs> Sorry, excuse me, I just need to... Cadet Gold, what are you doing here? Oh, you don't know? Really? It says right here, prisoner processing training. I'm your official trainee. Aren't you a little young for the Corps? Aren't you a little old for that hairdo? I should check with the captain. No. No, 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 no. She, she definitely signed off on this. You know how thorough she is about signing stuff? If I may, sir, the real concern here is Regulation 7A regarding prisoner footgear. That one's jet boots are in clear violation. They're decorative. Good work, Cadet Gold. Great. There goes Plan B. No, you do not got this, pirate. I got this. Now fall in line. Not to go, prisoners. Watch the jacket. To that gold. You know the arrest protocols? All memorized, sir. First thing we do... First thing you do is apologize. We're legitimate business-like folk on legitimate-like business. We're not hunting an illegal creature in illegal space. Everyone just do what they say. When I see Corral, I'll explain... The captain isn't going to see you. According to protocol, you're to be taken straight to the brig. Hold it right here. Is there a problem? Yes! No faith, energy, no power. No power. No containment. A single soul. The techs are looking at it. They say that... They cannot even fathom. How can they fix what they cannot understand? Put the Grand Unifier's mind at ease. Run the scanners again. The Flark is a Grand Unifier. Grand Unifier Raker. Leader of the Church of Universal something. He was floating dead in the quarantine zone. Looking for God. Let's go. We caught him just like we caught you. Difference is, I know the captain. As I was saying, if you just tell the captain that I Mom explicitly said she doesn't want to see you. Yeah, Quill. Wait. Did she Admit just it. say mom? Admit it, you know not Just to be no. super clear on the mom Okay. That was kind of amazing, huh? 
I can override them with my passkey. They give out override keys to trainees? Not exactly. Just give me a sec. Come on, come on. I you know I could probably help with the door if we undid these cuffs. Regulation 3B. Never undo restraints. Come on, you clearly need my help. No! You're my prisoner. And I got this. <sighs> Obviously. Ah! Okay, we're gonna have to find another way. You sure there isn't a way through here? I'm in charge here. A senior officer, a I... senior? Don't you mean- Whoa! <laughs> you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. You? Oh, dandy. Okay, this way. Shouldn't we be going up? Back toward the others? There's another blast door down here. Are you kidding me? I mentioned how useful my jet boots will be right now. Okay. I can do this. Not to rush you or anything. Almost there. Can you please stop squirming? I'm trying to focus. Okay, okay. Yes! Got it! Through here! Why is both out of here if you just... I'm not reactivating your boots. Any day now. Whew. <laughs> nice work. Thanks. You didn't do too bad yourself, pirate. Only Star-Lord. Or Peter, or, you know, Nova Cadet Butt Saver. Okay. Peter. So, listen. I have some good news and some bad news about your friends. Did you hear me? Give me the good news. They're all fine. I mean, they all have life signs. So, what's the bad news? They've been processed and put in the brig. In case you thought the explosion would give them a chance to escape or something. Hey, we're innocent, remember? No need to escape when you're innocent. Where do you think you're going? Just making sure this place is safe and secure from the, you know, fire. Come on. We'll be safe through here. Flark! Pipes must have burst. Should we try using that thingamajig of yours to call someone? We don't need help. I know what I'm doing. Now help me block this fire so we can get through. Sure. Just that everyone must be worried. Captain's kid goes missing. Captain's kid is still a corpsman. Now are you gonna help me or not? Yes, ma'am. Easy does it. You don't need to worry about me. Enough people around here do that already. For what it's worth, I think you're doing great. As good an arresting officer as I've ever had. Are you seriously trying to sneak away on me right now? You literally just said I was doing great. You are doing great. Top five best arresting officers I've ever had. Cool. So can you please just show me the same respect you would any other arresting officer? <laughs> That's exactly what I'm doing. Un 
Unbelievable. Yeah, I get that a lot. Is that robot wearing makeup? What? Oh, yeah. That's just it. I, um, I know all the bots down here. They're kind of my friends, I guess. I reprogrammed most of them. And gave them faces. Maybe. No, I mean, it's cool. Give them personality. Very cool. Come on, this way. Okay, wow. <laughs> That's just blatantly gonna ignore me and go crawling into a dead end. For your information, there's an escape hatch back here I could totally use to run away. But out of respect for your authority, I'm gonna, you know, ignore it and follow your lead. Regulation 2B. Prisoners must stay close at all times. Does your mom know you play down here? Probably not. But what else am I gonna do? Not like there's any other kids on board. You know, I didn't have a lot of friends at your age either. Granted, I was in prison, but still. So mom was right about you. It was a Shatari prison. I was just a kid. I have so many questions. Were your parents in prison too? No, my mom, uh, died. I didn't know my dad. How do you know my mom, exactly? Uh, we fought together on Mercury during the war. She was, a, is, a real spitfire. More like real controlling. And bossy, and judgmental. You're just a kid, Nikki. You don't know what's good for you, Nikki. Stay out of the escape pods, Nikki. <laughs> I kind of know what you mean. You do? This is a new low, Peter. Even for you, Peter. It's restricted space, Peter. <laughs> yep. That's her. Okay. Almost there. Almost where? You'll see. I'm still in charge here, you know. Of course you are. Any day now. Right, right. Just taking it all in. Yeah, could you please try to keep up? Hey, you try walking around in cuffs. Quick reminder that only one of us. It's a dead end. Trust me. Of course I trust you. Clearly. Get back here, pirate. Wow, wow, okay. Could have sworn I heard Corel there for a second. Ugh, are you kidding me? This is an attempt to escape your mom's ship. I really need to know, because I may or may not be super interested. Just really need to make sure it doesn't look like a kidnapping. What? No, no. Oh, wow. Don't laugh. No, no. This is cool. It's like your secret hideout, right? I definitely prefer this to the brig. We're not staying. I just need to check on Ultimo. His gyros have been all screwed. Take your time. Hey, this is Mercury, right? Uh-huh. It's supposed to represent this big battle Mom was part of. You said you were there, right? Oh, yeah. Your mom was dead in the water until me and the Ravagers showed up. You should really fix this. You... Want me to draw you in? In the interest of historical accuracy. Is this... Krilar? Uh, yeah. Long time ago. Kid stuff. I could do it way better now. No, no, it's good. Morbid, but good. Is this your mom? Single-handedly winning the war? Obviously, I know she didn't do it by herself. No. That final push was, uh... It was a massive team effort. Were you there? Uh, I contributed to the war effort differently. Pirating? Raiding, which is, you know, the good kind of pirating. Something tells me you and Rocket would get along. Or really, really not get along. One of those two. The raccoon thing? Yeah, he seemed real charming. I just mean he's also really into all this tech stuff. Hey, secret stuff. Off limits. No adults. I get it. Anyway, I'm all done here. 
We should probably get back before mom completely freaks. Yeah, I've seen your mom overreact before. It's like I'm not a kid anymore, you know? Tell me about it. So, you get where I'm coming from, right? Like if you do end up talking to my mom, the subject of me happens to come up. Say no more. I'll make sure Corel knows what a good job you did. No! I mean, thanks. But ideally, Mom never needs to know I was in the hangar at all. So I never saw you? Exactly! Never saw me. Never saw my passkey. You may have heard of Nikki Gold and how cool she is, but that's it. <sighs> Almost at the elevator. We're home free. Ah! Almost there. Need a hand? Yes! Got it! Mom? I can explain. <sighs> Nikki. I'm fine. Mom, seriously. A okay. Barely a scratch. What in Hall's name were you thinking? Sneaking out with an arresting squad. Running around with criminals. Alleged criminals. You almost died. Do you have any idea how grounded you are right now? Mom! You promised to give me more leeway. Leeway doesn't mean lying to my officers. Or sneaking around behind my back. Look, it's my fault some guy's ship blew up. Restricted areas are restricted for a reason. You treat me like a prisoner! You're a child! Are you even listening? Whoa, whoa! We've all been through a lot today. Let's just all take a deep breath. And... <clears throat> recognize that... Maybe we've all made some mistakes? Make sure the fire is out and the hangar's secure. Yes, Commander. And find out why that churchman's shuttle exploded. Grand Unifier Raker has been less than cooperative. Make him cooperate. And you two? With me. I knew you'd overreact. You always overreact. Even Peter was saying so. Oh, he was, was he? I suspect Peter misspoke, something he often tends to do. So I suggest you worry less about what he said, and more about what I'm saying now. What you did was extremely dangerous. Do you even get that? It wasn't that dangerous. For what it's worth, Nikki totally saved my butt. She handled herself really well. You have every reason to be proud of her. Coming from you, Peter, it's worth extraordinarily little. Why are you being mean to him? Just listen to what he's saying. I don't care what he's saying. Upper level. Captain's quarters. Finally. Initiate lockdown. Lockdown initiated. What, are you gonna kill us? In theory, these doors don't open until I say so. Yeah, I know how lockdown works. I don't think you do, because somehow you keep bypassing every security measure on this ship, and I want to know how. Or you can just show me. Mom. You know, this reminds me of the last time I was stuck in an elevator. I was with this Shi'ar girl, and she was... Ew! What is wrong with you? She was a lovely person. Someone, please get out of here. No one leaves until you tell me what I want to know. You already know everything! No, I don't. I know you're a magnet for danger, and that you somehow keep getting caught in restricted areas of this ship. I'm small. Okay. I fit into places. Being small doesn't get you past security, or through the hangar bay checkpoint, or the maintenance tunnel blast doors. There was that system-wide glitch, remember? Yeah. Yeah, security was down for a while. And... No, it wasn't. Seemed pretty down to me. Are you seriously lying for a 12-year-old right now? 12? Oh, wow, I thought she was at least 16. Peter! What? She really knew her stuff. She's a smart kid too smart. She keeps bypassing security. Unless you have a level 6 access to my ship all of a sudden? Didn't think so. Nicolette Gold, empty your pockets. No. You empty your pockets. Nikki? What? I know you're hiding something. It was me. Yeah, all those locked doors back there, I, I hacked them. You hacked them? Yeah, I'm a hacker now. I, I hack stuff. You know. Beep, bop, boop. Boop, boop, beep. That doesn't explain the falsified orders. I don't know what to tell you, Mom. Your security staff have been sleeping on the job. 
All I know is I'm not hiding anything. I wouldn't do that. To be continued. Disengage lockdown. So, can I go help secure the hangar now? No, you can go back to your quarters and you can stay there for the next 30 rotations. But Mom! I can make it 30 cycles. <laughs> <laughs>